Hello everyone, I'm Conquering History Games, and welcome back to part 26 of my Byzantine Empire campaign here in Crusade of Kings 2. So, I spent a little bit of time thinking about it, and I've decided what I'm going to do <clears throat> is, uh, first off, we're going to let some time go by, just let my you know land recover, save up some more money and whatnot, because uh, I'm probably going to need a lot of it, as, as we're going to see in a minute. Uh, what's the successor nomination? Yeah, my son. It's always gonna be my son. There we go. Cool. So, uh, yeah, I just I just want to give my vassals time to have everybody feel better, like all their all their levies and stuff start to recover. <clears throat> and uh, what I'm gonna do because it's gonna take a pretty long time until I can. Uh, what's this? Oh, I could do this. Yeah, there we go. Now she's not so mad. Uh, okay, who else is mad? I'm going to probably do another series of holy wars, like I've done before. Um, let's see, give you a title here. What's your problem, dude? Desire is the kingdom of Trebizond. You know what? That's actually fine, and you can keep that. Permanently, because you're a member of the family. That's what family means. So you have your cool son, who's gonna have one, two, three, four, five, six, six right here. These are super important characters. These are gonna have six bloodlines. Their kid one day. The genetics, the breeding program. <laughs> uh, but anyway, what I'm saying is, we're we're gonna. Okay, it looks like we're pretty much recovered. We're going to give a slight imbalance in money, declare a series of holy wars here, and try to uh, eat up a lot of the Eastern Mediterranean. Now, these are all Catholic domains down here in, uh, yeah, in Egypt, so we can't really go after them. I was thinking about maybe going after the Abbasids too to get a really, really big bite, but they're fine where they're at. So we're going to declare some on Rum, the Romite Revolt, and then I'm just going to start going down and figuring out some more from there. Okay. Okay. First things first, and we're going for big bites. Uh, so, like, we want... who we want? Right here, I think there's... no, that's only two counties. Uh, two right here. Samos is just two. That was up here, right? Okay, I think we might do Samos. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, and I figure it's okay if we do... It's just like last time if we declare the multiple wars because, oh, no, the Sunnis are going to help anyway. Well, if I'm fighting them all anyway, I might as well grab a bunch of territory while I'm at it. Okay, now for the revolt. Tunga the Fat. Let's see. What's this? Three? Not bad. Not bad. Cappadocia, it's just... It's just not very much, is it? It's just the two... One over there for Trebizond. Uh, I guess we'll get Cappadocia. Then these areas are kind of close. All right, that's two. Over here we have this uh, one of the Seljuks. I think this is separate from a different Seljuk that's out here somewhere. No? Am I imagining things? Okay. We want these two. Yeah, here. Cilicia, for sure. All right, that's three wars now. Uh, the Mustafadid, or because you know, I, I basically need all of this. I need to go all the way to the Persian Gulf to eventually restore the border. So I'm going to need this at one point or another. Um, so this is the Abbasid Caliph. He's out here. Okay, we don't want to mess with that. But the Ali Emirate, Sayed. Okay, Galilee, right? Galilee, no, Galilee only gives me one. Tripoli gives me two. Okay, do you think four wars is enough? You know what? I've done four wars before. Let's let's crank it up a notch. What do you guys think? Yeah? Um, Holy War for... Yeah, Escalon. That's going to give me four. Or not four. That'll give me three. That's probably going to be my best bet. Um, there's only two there. One... Big bites, remember big bites. Yeah, let's just get that and increase the size of my little purple area here. And then this is this is the Abbasids. 
No, this is Damascus. Oh, no, I'm already at war with him up here. Okay, cool. So we're continuing the process of encapsulating the Mediterranean. Um, we've only got about 250 years to go <laughs> to uh, to get everything we're going to need. I, it's a lot. Let's continue. Once again, we're reviewing, reviewing this. It's a lot we have to go through. Uh, basically, into you know, Armenia, we've got to take a lot of modern-day Iraq. It's it's quite a lot. We haven't taken anything in Spain yet. Almost nothing in North Africa. A lot to be done still. Okay. So, we, uh, I don't think any of those nations have more than 5,000 available to them. Let's call it 6,000, so even 6,000 times 5, that's about 30,000. I've got more. Ooh, I forgot to hit control. Whoops. Uh, it's about to get ugly then. No, we can figure this out. Uh, we'll, we'll go ahead and disband them. Uh, disband all these little island areas. Yeah, you're good. Get on the boat. You all. I think come over here. And of course, all my European... Vassals should be able to easily move to Constantinople. Let's get rid of these raiders real quick. Yeah, just kind of... Everybody just sort of assemble here in Nicaea. Just in that general area. Uh, we should have some more over here somewhere. No. Just a few. Nothing in France. Hmm. Okay. Uh, we have some more people here. Another 2200. That's not nothing. Bring them over and nothing in Jerusalem. Strange. Okay. Are we actually going to avoid all those nasty early fights for once? No, come here and then up. Oh, wow! That host is f was fighting hard. Did you guys see that? So... Let's see... Von Sponheim. Hmm. Checking some things here. Trade zones and governments. See, I don't look that big when you see it this way. Look at all this ikta. These guys still have not formed the empire. I'm looking forward to this. <laughs> it's, uh... It's always... I find it fun whenever I see, um... The AI form an empire. Maybe it's just me. Alright, we got 2700 ready to go. Get on the boat, up on the boat, and over to Samos. Oh, nice! I just got the uh, the claim on the Prince Bishopric of Latium. Excuse me. What? Uh oh, I think that's just how it's Prince Bishopric of At. Nice. So that's all three of these. Definitely gonna use that. Hold on, I just remembered, have I been in debt to the Jews this whole time? Wow. Yeah, I keep forgetting to pay them back. It's, I'm just taking penalties uh, for no reason from my uh, my vassals, my temple vassals. Alright. The Sardinian invasion of Anatolia. What? You want to run that by me again? That's a weird one. It's some mercenary. We've decided to reclaim a little of what is owed us forcefully. How many? What? I've been paying them. I can't remember the last war I had where I couldn't afford to keep my mercenaries. This is ridiculous. Okay, so I think we're actually not going to attack the... Um... <sighs> we need to focus actually on... The rum war. Yeah, we gotta... We probably gotta deal with that first. Threaten him with exposure. That's not gonna do anything. Yep. The usual! Right. 
let's merge these all together and we're going in here. I think this was the area I was taking, right? This is Cappadocia. Let me just double check that. Yeah, Cappadocia. So we're going to try to prioritize that a little bit. It's also where a lot of the enemy are going to be coming from though, so this army is going to take first contact. Uh oh. Incoming! Incoming in Constantinople! I think we're okay. What do we got here? The Romite Revolt. Let's actually take that. Some mountains. It's gonna hurt, but it must be done. Good, good, good. Um. Wait, don't I already have the claim? Didn't I just get it? Right, right, I'm supposed to check the ledger, that's faster. Um, where's the... here we go, our claimants. Aaron, Prince Bishopric of Latium. Yeah, so let that go and just get some piety. Okay, so we finished that. We'll go have him fabricate something else. Uh, what's another duchy I'm going to want? Is Latium... I think I need, yeah, I need Ferrara because that has the uh, that has Ravenna, which is one of the later capitals of the West. So I guess it's needed. So if I get this and I get this, I think, I think, I'll have everything but Alexandria. Let me double check that. So I'm missing, I'm missing three of the duchies I need right now. No, because also Sicily. Soon. Give it a generation or two. We're, we're gonna get there. Uh, kidnappers overpowered me. I managed to... F they've managed to free me and capture them. Okay, what is going on? Is somebody trying to kill me? Who's trying to kill Stephania? No! No! Her bloodline is too important. Stop it. Lost a siege somewhere. Oh, I forgot about all these these guys over here too. My demand is just. You're damn right my demand is just. Okay, anyone trying to get me? Countess, I don't see Basilia. So many plots. So many that do not even matter to me. I can get money. 81 gold. Oh yeah, let's do that. That's that guy who was uh, a host against me, leading a host against me. It's fine that I'm letting him go. If it's not him, it would be somebody else. Might as well get some money. That's the way I see it. Start marching down here. The assassins are destroyed. Was that the third time in this campaign? That they've been destroyed? Can't keep up? Right, how's it looking over here? No, no, don't assault it. Do not do it. Oh, you know what it is? It's all these other people I'm fighting. So, like, for example, Damascus, he's... He's, uh, he's really starting to take it to me here around Antioch, so we need to go after him in a minute here. I think we could just assault some of these, though. Oh, wow. Uh, Prince, Prince Bishopric of Ravenna. So, again, just checking. Uh, I could just barely afford it. I'll get the money back in a second. So, Prince, Prince Bishopric of Ravenna. No, it's up here. Of, or, no, it's something different. Of Ravenna. Yeah, oh, it's only this by itself. No, let that go. We'll take the piety. Uh, alright. Whoa, that's a big army, baby. It's two big armies. Uh, I think it's time to go join them. Duke Nikialos has inherited Duchy of Cephalonia. Alright, that's all fine. Yes, this is the breeding program one. Good, good. Yes, hang out in those islands off the coast. So when you're of age, you'll have privacy. Um, 
No, actually. I'm not going to allow that. Okay, we are defeating one of their armies over here. You know what? We gotta... Oh, they took these. Alright, let, let's get over here to Antioch. We're, we're actually just going to send this guy around, start having him beat up uh, armies before they get together too much. Things like that. Oh, this is bad. Nope, nope, ran right into all those reinforcements. Oh, shoot. That hurt. That hurt bad. It's okay. It's okay. We're gonna we're gonna win it all right now. That's a hundred percent. Okay. War one complete. Time to regroup. Regroup. Figure out what we're doing here. We're gonna go over here to Sardis, uh, or maybe not even Sardis actually. We're gonna we're gonna come over here and take these guys from behind. Plus, it'll let me go through my own territory and reinforce along the way. That's great. We really got to get over there to Damascus, though. It's getting out of control. Right, in the meantime, come down here. Message about erasing, arranging a marriage. We propose that me and him marry. We offer a bride price of 302 Okay, well, if you want to give me money, uh, that's fine by me. Uh, so, I have the daughter here, sibling, no, no sibling of mine, or of my family. Hmm. Negotiate with Ali, no. We've got to get these Damascans, though. They are rapidly taking a lot of my territory, and it's getting annoying. Okay. I think we can catch this guy in time. Destroy him as well. Uh huh. Okay, good. Oh, we caught a sheik. Merge everybody so we have the super awesome death stack. Uh, I cannot assault a level 6 or above. Okay, if that's the case. We gotta go deal with the Damascans. <clears throat> Actually, we gotta be very careful about how we walk through these areas. There's all sorts of armies running around. All kinds of people at war with one another. Uh, so what's what's causing the worst of this? Okay, it's because he still controls Cilia. Let's take Adan, Adan, Adana now. Okay. Assault that. Great. Just like that, I have some breathing room. Well, not really, actually. I lost all these areas down in Taros. This is, uh... Wait, no, where, what are the areas it's saying I've, I've lost a lot of? Tarsos. Where's Tarsos again? Of Tarsus. Oh, here. Okay. So if I attack here, uh, I'm going to deal with the river penalty. Okay. Let's just give it a minute, finish this siege, and then we'll go liberate them. Now we go up and around. Let's destroy their men more than anything. Quick assaults. We are losing a lot of these fights. <laughs> a whole lot. I feel like I should maybe prioritize the Rumite revolt a little bit. I know a lot of this is ticking war score that's causing the problem. And I think five might have been too much. Yeah, it's not like I'm going after the same person each time. Um, oh, hey, more children! Great, we're gonna give you Smyrna. And you also get. No. You have a sibling. Let's give him the Duchy of Genoa and everything under it as well. He's now the new part of a new great house over there. Oh, our dynasty is so great. Just 
all over the place. Now against the Rumites, uh, a lot of they're getting twenty five percent because they still control Cappadocia. The blood of Alexandra. <gasps> yes. Oh, geez, this takes a lot of gold, though. I think. Legends about Alexander the Great and his epic campaign across Asia are told throughout the known world. Countless young rulers have wasted their lives in their hopeless attempts to emulate the immortal achievements of this legendary figure. Having died young, after fathering only one child, Alexander was unable to establish an imperial dynasty. Despite his many accomplishments, tragically dooming his empire to fall shortly after its creation. <clears throat> rulers of all creeds and nations claim to trace their ancestors to the fleeting line of Alexandria, Alexander, yet none have been able to... Have such a prestigious claim be recognized by their peers and subjects uh we're gonna try we're going to try 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 nice we got some money i think we can afford some mercenaries now where's my holy order i actually don't even know where they're at they're, they're here okay um let's hire uh oh yeah i forgot about the stupid sardinian man where are they anyway Wait, where are they? Okay, they're running around up there. Okay, we can deal with that after we take this first holding. No problem. Just to get them off the board. If they're not around, they can't fuck with me. <clears throat> okay, I was going to... Mer mercenaries, mercenaries, right. Um, so... We just need bodies. We'll go with the company. God damn, why are the Victal brothers so expensive? Swiss man, Lombard band. There, that's plenty, I think. Let's kind of come over here and, uh, oh, the rum. The rum are gone. It's fine. That just means I can concentrate on other things. I will never be satisfied. Let's come over here and, uh, destroy the band. Yeah, I just want to get them off the board. The Tomb of Alexander. The location of the hollowed grounds where the Great Conqueror was put to his final rest has been con a contested topic for millennia. Many Roman emperors of old have claimed to have visited the tomb of Alexander during the rise to power, yet its true location still eludes modern scholars. The recovery of my ancestors' sacred remains would surely strengthen my claim to his bloodlines, yet wasting time and resources in quests that many have already failed to accomplish in the past might not be the wisest course of action, especially given how far my expedition would have to travel to reach the most likely locations of the tomb. It's imperative we can use your intrigue and invest wealth, uh, we could use learn establishing a valid claim would be a better investment. Use your learning and invest well, or abandon the quest. I'm no longer ambitious and I become depressed. I lose three thousand prestige, which I wouldn't even notice was gone. So I've got pretty good learning, right? Yeah, I got I got seventeen learning. So establishing a valid claim would be a better investment of resources. Forging the ancestry. Historians agree that Alexander had a son named after him born of a Bactrian princess. Yet the life of this child is shrouded by mystery. The empire he was supposed to inherit from his father had long been split amongst greedy warlords by the time Alexander's son became a man, making it impossible for him to succeed. Fearing retaliation from the Diadochi, it is no surprise that Alexander's wife would flee from his army and hide the child from assassination attempts. It is not so far-fetched to think that their descendants found refuge to Constantinople eventually and split into the Komnenos. My scholars only need to find the right references in, this an in the ancient accounts of my dynasty to uncover this prestigious link. So this is basically how Rome is tracing itself back to Aeneas <laughs> going on here. Uh, I'll provide everything you need. 17,032 gold. No scroll must remain untouched. Uh, we're going to do it. If I'm doing this, I'm going all the way with it. So now I'm in unbelievable debt. And every now I've lost my entire mercenary army. So, um, I think the bloodline is more important. I actually don't even know what the bloodline does now that I think about it. Uh, alright. We've got to start working on a lot of this now. We, we, we still have a negative monthly balance. Uh, shoot. Time is sort of on our side. Where's the Sardinian? Really? We didn't defeat the Sardinian band? It's fine. See, the bad thing is, this isn't like the Crusade. I'm not on the defensive. So, I don't get to just constantly reinforce my armies. 
but we can at least constantly attack theirs. We have quite a few people we haven't raised also. Okay, I need to get rid of these galleys. These galleys are probably sucking up a lot of money too. Dismiss them. Alright, where are we at? Excellent! Monthly balance corrected. See, and even with me being bankrupt, basically, uh, we're still doing real good. You have to go over there to the Sabuku. Uh oh, somebody got caught somewhere. Get over here, get over here, get over here. Um. Okay, wait, no, come here, then here, and then here. And then we gotta go south and take at least one or two of these provinces just to reset the clock a bit. Oh, that's a big army. That's a big ass army. After the council meeting, he has discovered a rare artifact. Oh, nice. 50 years old and still doing good work for me. The evil? Of course not. You should arrange it. Yeah, he's he, he can pull this off. I wonder what the rare artifact will be. Oh, oh, oh how gleeful I feel. There we go. Alright, now we've got to go... Uh, okay, let's let that army get a little bit ahead of us. Then we're going to come down here. I def There was definitely no reason for me to have all these wars at once. Well, I guess I... No, it makes sense. Wants to kill my courtier. Sure. That reminds me, let's get ransoming every bit counts. Fight the Turks! Give generously! Uh, I don't pull in the prisoners like I used to. Right, uh, I just got a duchy. I think that's too many now. No, I'm good. Right. Looks like we're doing okay. Hang in there. During the chaos, my men cornered Bay Yamin of Shimaka, who was cut down with ease. Good riddance. Alright, we're doing we're doing very well. Alright, that was against um, these guys, the Sobu Kid. Uh something about a plot. Am I a drunkard now? What the hell? No. So just randomly I got drunk. Whatever. Ah. How annoying. Good, good. Got a special tithe. Okay. Form, uh, forging the Ancestry. It took us countless sleepless nights spent reading ancient tomes and pursuing forgotten scrolls, but we have finally achieved our goal. Under my lead, my group of scholars has been able to trace a lineage from the earliest known members of the Komnenos dynasty and the most plausible line of descendants from the glorious conqueror himself. The only thing that is left now to validate my claim in the eyes of my peers and subjects... The only thing that is left now, excuse me, excuse me. Hold on, I gotta turn on the light in here, give me a second. Okay, there, can see better now. Um, the only thing that is left now, I got, I got backlight, basically. Uh, the only thing that is left now to validate my claim in the eyes of my peers, it, that is left now is to validate my claim in the eyes of my peers and subjects. Many envious upstarts are sure likely to dismiss my findings, jealous of my illustrious ascendancy. I will need to make sure that their voices are drowned out in the celebration for this momentous discovery. Oh my gosh, by investing a large amount of resources, you will greatly increase your chance of success. 10,000 prestige. Wow. That's, uh, that one I did feel a little bit. Riding over the hill, I see a group of pompous soldiers coming for my unit, weapons raised. When they are finished with us, all my men are dead. I sink to my knees in the dirt, wondering why I'm still here. Uh, minus 14. No, we're gonna run for it. Damn it. Uh, that's not good. <clears throat> Just a few months, though. Oh, see, they finally attacked me up here. I was waiting, wondering what was taking them so long. But we're trending positive. If this was easy, everyone would do it. The conversion of Sklava. Don't particularly care. Uh, 
Uh, I need to find some more troops somewhere in the world. There we go. Yes! Now we're cooking with gas. Let's get them over here. Uh, you, you, who else is up? You, you. Plenty of reinforcements. Everybody assemble in Constantinople. Uh, yeah, I kept, forgot to hit control again. Oh me. Just can't get it together, can I? A monthly balance, which is still fine, because that's my vassals' levies I'm raising. Just go ahead and merge, we'll be fine. Yes, just like that. I'm all better. Well, not all better, but much better at least. Okay, you guys get on the boat. Some of the mob, give me a bribe, give me a bribe, give me a bribe. Nope, didn't work. <laughs> you can hope for these things, but there's never a guarantee. Uh, 2700, I know I got more than that. Waiting. Okay, just assemble, assemble, assemble. Alright. Now, I need you guys to get on a freaking boat. Excellent. Oh, even with the boat, I'm still good. Let's come over here. Great, great, great. Still wanting me to negotiate with the terrorists. I still haven't taken any of Ali either. Where's that Sardinian band? Right there. Okay. I think we're going to be able to deal with them on our own. Was that my army? Okay. These guys are all set. Mostly. Uh, wasn't there 1,700 or so men coming from the south? Or from the north, excuse me. Okay. Just a couple more we've got to all get together. Then we're going to go take out the band. Actually, we need to destroy this army over here. Before it merges into something bigger. Right. Good, 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 good. Right, you get on the boat. I think you guys are ready to go. Uh, go to the north specifically, then come down and take out the Sardinians. What's this? We can usurp something? Duchy of Lothane. Not a priority right now. Oh, who am I kidding? Of course it is. How much is it going to cost me? Just 100 gold. That's fine. We're going to accidentally create Britannia up here. I'm not even doing anything. It's, it's kind of funny that the, there's such a consistent progression up there, and yet uh, that's like an area I don't even care about. Let's uh, do something about these guys, too. Just get them out of the way. Alright, quick victory. Awesome. How's it going over here? Uh-oh, did we lose? No, no, no. Here they come. We're coming down like a freaking hammer on them. What? That was a river crossing? There's no river there. That's stupid. No, no. Yeah, I'm screwed. But that was dumb. That was... No, there's not a river there. The river's up here. That's... I, re I refuse. Lies. And I just got defeated down here as well. Or I'm about to, anyway. Uh, I'm super de duper lucky. I can reinforce these guys in time, but I don't think so. Maybe. Oh, maybe, maybe. Yes, yes, yes! Awesome. What is the deal? Is this. Am I gonna get this bloodline or what? Damn. 1500. There's still like. It's so like 20,000 just in this section right here. Uh, let's see. He sought me out with concerns regarding the relic. He asked me to issue a decree allowing his treasure hunters to appropriate the resources and they men they need from the local burgers. Uh, that's fine. It's better be something cool. I want quality 4. Actually, I don't think you can get quality 4 off this quest, so uh, ignore that. Yeah, we're taking it all back up there. We have to do something about the Ali Emirate as well. Are we about to defeat these ones? Yeah, we should just 
really commit here. Okay, that puts us at 80. 85. Need a bit more. Need a bit more. I'm trying to take it back. Okay, cool. We caught them. We caught them, even though we're coming off the boat. Fall of the Teutonic State. Well, that didn't last long, did it? After, uh... After losing their fi finally losing their final bastion, the Teutonic Knights are once more landless and have started traveling back to the core lands of Christendom. As they no longer have a realm of their own, they are once more known as the Teutonic Order. They will offer their services to whatever Christian lord or lady fighting the infidels. The fall of the Teutonic State is surely a blow to the Catholics. Those of the Order are not meant to rule. Only the first to many to fall. Yes, it's false Christianity over there. Uh-oh, don't crash on me now. Don't crash on me, bro! Yep, I'm gonna lose them. Why do I keep splitting them up when I'm this strung out? Why, why, why? Why do I keep making the same mistakes? That's not, yeah, that didn't do shit. Um, got a few hundred over here. That's it. I need mercenaries again. Let's just go with one, maybe? Uh. Bring them down and around. See, now I'm running at a very slight deficit. Nothing too serious. 97. Damascus is about to win. Uh, get over here, get over here, get over here, and then we can rush him. We've almost got it. The Duchess has unearthed authentic love letters proving the desperate... Gregorius of Epirus is actually a bastard. His mother, Queen Rodothane II, had a torrid love affair with Count Aaron of Corkian. How should I use this uh, information? Denounce him, giving me a reason for arrest and revocation. No, 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 no. Uh, we'll just threaten him with exposure, I guess. But he's family. Although, actually, he's probably not family. <laughs> I think that's actually the point. He's not family. Uh... Okay, there it is. Ah, uh, we're lost. Yeah, we lost the one against Damascus, but at least we picked up this. Oh, damnation. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I think we're getting a reset, kinda. Okay, cool. We just gotta get a couple holdings right here in Tripoli. Uh, maybe not Tripoli. Let's try this one. Better luck one county over. Yes! Okay, and... Assault. There it is. Aha! The heir of Alexander. After years of study, research, and investment, I have finally achieved my goal and eternally bound my dynasty's name to one of the greatest conquerors of known history. Long after I am gone, people will look at my descendants in awe and tremble at the very thought of meeting them on the field of battle. Within our veins flows the same strength that subjugated Egypt, the same genius that cracked Babylon, the same ambition that led one man to travel from the heart of civilization to the edge of the world. Eternal glory awaits. Become known as the founder of a bloodline. Am I the founder? I don't, I don't just get it in every single member of my family. Uh, so, what, what does that give us? Uh, okay, it's gotta be, it's matrilineal transfer, so that um, is a problem. These kids have just become, this girl is the most important thing in the world right now. Uh, oh, I wanna like reduce, I wanna like revoke all of his titles and make him come live with me. Just lock him up somewhere until she's of age. Uh, anyway, so so let's actually take a look here at what the blood does before we end it. Prestige, plus 20, uh, plus, zero point, er, plus 0 0.020 zero a month. Hellenic Opinion, plus 5. Reformed Hellenic Opinion, plus 5. Levy Reinforcement Rate, plus 15%. Personal Combat Skill, plus 10. And I can use Invasion once per lifetime, so... Um, I need to double check that, but I think invasion means that I could, I could get an entire kingdom at once. So I'll, I'll check that. Uh, thanks to the efforts of Basilia LXM, the Komnenos dynasty has been universally acknowledged as being directly descended from Alexander the Great. So like my son does not have, or no, he does because it was matrilineal, but his children do not have it. It, it, it basically immediately stops. Uh... Guy doesn't have something here you're another member of the family let's give you Escalon 
And then you get the rest of it as well, I think. I should think. Uh, wait a minute, do I have to... Yeah, I have to usurp it first. Alright, let me just do this real quick so I don't forget to do it later. I'm trying to keep everything, as much of it, within my dynasty as possible. Uh, okay, so, thank you very much for joining me. That was an awesome episode, even though we had a couple of bad things happen, but that's my f It was completely my own fault. Um, I just wasn't playing things well. And in the next one, hopefully we can run up and grab, uh, this holding from Damascus. Actually, let me see if I can do it right now, real quick. Okay. Okay, we did it. Was that enough? No, because he still holds Cecilia. Really? It's not Lycandos, Saros. What? Am I looking at the wrong thing? Who is this? Of Damascus. Right? Whatever. I'll figure this out next episode. Well, we're probably going to lose the war against Damascus. We still have to defeat the Sardinians. And uh, we're going to work on the al ally Emirates. But I just. So that's a lesson learned. Don't fight five wars at the same time. Uh. I will see you around. Have a great one. Hail me, because I am Alexander's heir. Goodbye.